We are just 10 weeks away from the federal election, and we now know which party leaders have been invited to the two major election debates and which one in particular has not. Now, on, on the invite list, the Bloc Québécois, Conservative, Green, Liberal, and NDP leaders. But Maxime Bernier, leader of the People's Party of Canada, not invited. That news was delivered by David Johnston, commissioner of the debate organizing group. That could still change. The party's relatively new, only formed last year after Bernier left the Conservatives. The first debate is set for October 7th. Chris Hall is our national affairs editor in Ottawa and, of course, host of The House on CBC Radio. So, Chris, essentially there was a, a list of criteria to get an invitation and Bernier didn't meet enough of them. That's right. He only meets one of the three criteria, and you need to meet two. And the reason primarily, Andrew, is that he leads a new party that's never elected an MP. But I think what got our attention in all of this is the criteria around which uh, David Johnson really is excluding the, the PPC and Maxim Bernier, and that is that he doesn't believe, based on public opinion polling and seat projections, that the PPC has a legitimate chance uh, of winning more than one seat. That said, it's a preliminary decision. He's given Maxime Bernier until August uh, the 23rd to come up with three to five ridings to submit that he believes the party has a good chance of winning and any other evidence by September the 9th that warrants including uh, Maxime Bernier in this debate. So not a lot of time to meet those demands. Yeah, but no surprise here, Maxime Bernier has already responded in sort to this. What did he have to say? Yeah, he did respond by saying he was disappointed, obviously, in the decision and saying it doesn't take into account the political context or the fact that the PPC is a populist party. Here's part of what he said. The statement says, the PPC represents a unique perspective. It is the only party that offers distinct policy positions on several topics that are at the heart of political debates, including immigration, climate change, freedom of expression, corporate welfare, foreign aid, supply management, and many other topics. Whether they have a list to submit and what those writings might be that they could win, I didn't get an answer. But of course, getting into the debates is really important for any leader, let alone one of a new party, to show what your positions are, to be able to allow voters to contrast and compare how you compare to the other leaders. So uh, clearly, the PPC will continue to make the case that it belongs, and its ma leader, Maxime Bernier, belongs in these debates. Chris Hall in Ottawa, thanks so much. Thanks, Andrew.